it in the middle to make sure he stays onside. Gerrard is straight from the right. Here's Finnan. Xavi Alonso, it's good passing this from Liverpool. The coach for Aston Villa and then got the top job himself. So, no surprising if the allegiances are still there. Gerrard with Norway. Gerrard. Judge that better than Barry, who's just been able to reposition. Xavi Alonso. And just wanders across the, the front two. Very difficult to pick up. He's made a run to the right and got the ball from Cissé. Here's Gerrard, who fact wasn't going for goal. He saw Luis Garcia coming in. Well, Rush and Phillips were still making their way back. I don't think it was a goal scoring opportunity, but definitely next. But he's a talent, still very young. Javi Alonso, Gerard. Oh, he's telling Stephen Davis that ball's got to be played in a lot earlier. Well, Cissé's timed his run brilliantly. He's in at Sorison here. Best chance for Liverpool. And the goalkeeper defending initially from really when Liverpool have the ball. No one puts Stephen Gerrard under pressure. It's a brilliant ball. I'm not sure there what Gareth Barry and Liam Ridgewell are doing between the two of them because important save this could be but just have a look at the defending there I don't know whether Gareth Barry thinks it's he says offside but Ridgewell clearly playing him on Gerard, uh, with the license to roam again even to go it's totally opposite from what yeah, we've just seen absolutely Morientes. Gerard booming the ball. Barry at times has found this game a little bit uncomfortable as a left back. You know, he really doesn't do it. Gerard is given offside at a time where you feel a goal, if Aston Villa were to concede one, it would have a shattering mm. effect on David O'Leary's team. Well, it was a late flag, but uh, a little play from Garcia as uh, he chips that ball into the danger area. There's again Steven Gerrard just. Just uh, moments, there have been moments in this match where you can see why uh, he was picked for England. He's a little bit unlucky, hasn't he, over uh, recent years with injury, to be fair to, to go. They've got to uh, capitalise on their possession. And just about everything has gone through that man. Let's rejoin Brian Marwood and Martin Tyler. Yes, Marcus, it's his 300th game for Liverpool. I guess we'd be talking 400 plus up for the injury problems he's had earlier in his career. The first period, precious few real chances. That's Sissoko is in strongly, that's not through for Barosh. God, incidentally. Sissoko, but Finnan across to Gerard. Back to the season's group. Gerard able to turn. This is. Uh, a wasted opportunity, I think. They would have thought that coming here, and uh, also the way the game is shaped up. Gerard's cross. This time he did, but couldn't find him. Gerard a bit more room to play it. Gerard making a run towards the near post. Gerard! It's a fantastic save by Thomas Sorensen from Steve. For the right sort of delivery, he does that. And Steven Gerrard's Liverpool attack. That's a great strike, isn't it, from the Liverpool skipper? And uh, there's not an awful lot for him to aim at. He sees it late. He's got a lot of pace on this strike. That's a wonderful save. Really is a wonderful save. He's a mixture, isn't he? At times, Thomas Sorensen. We saw him come for a cross. Spect. Gerrard. Gerrard. Dropping ball beautifully. Run. And that clean sheet's not in the bag yet. Steve Bennett gave them a draw in a game in which they were losing. This could well give them a win. Gerard does the job. Come. 
and composed. What you'd expect from your skipper. We'll feel uh, badly done by a few weeks. He's having to learn the hard way. But uh, he really did slot it home with great aplomb. And I said earlier that Liverpool would be kicking themselves if they didn't win this game because they've had the majority of the possession in the second period in particular. They came in controversial circumstances. It doesn't really matter how they come. Well, he scored the goal. It's his tenth of the season, incidentally. But Peter Crouch involved in it. Kuehl. Here's Gerrard. Need to get it forward. Barry's lost out, and Liverpool can look dangerous again. Even Gerrard took on the responsibility from the penalty. And a big performance from that man at the back, Jamie Carragher. Dave, you can't feel sorry for yourself. I'm going to spin Crouch's horse from a Steven Gerrard penalty, which uh, Aston Villa may well dispute.